Well, Corey, the schedule's been a little bit all over the place of late, but you've had a, a few days off. Uh, have they been useful for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always good to uh, have a little bit of time to to reflect and and refresh. You know, get your energy back and um, get ready for the next game. And uh, you know, especially my age, get a little uh, get a little break and get ready to go again. Prepare for 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 the next uh, run of games. So um, obviously, it came at a time where we got. A few back-to-back -back wins, so maybe it would have been nice to carry on. But um, you know, we've had a good international break. Um, the boys have come back looking looking really sharp, worked hard. Um, the boys that have been away have enjoyed themselves, and yeah, um, we're happy to be back. I mean, the fixture list has been busy. Lots of games in, in lots of competitions as well, and, and more to come. How physically are you holding up with that? Yeah, no. To be fair, I feel good. Um, it's probably the first time that I've had a proper like pre-season for a few years, to be honest. So maybe that's helping me a little bit, you know. Um, obviously, everyone knows that the pre-seasons here are, are very tough. So um, yeah, we had a maybe that's uh, carried on for me, and I feel I feel good, feel feel sharp, and um, yeah, I'm looking forward to to the next run of games. He talks about the the run of form. Unfortunately, you went into the break off the back of that FA Cup defeat to Crew. Is is that still in the system, or have you very much been able to move on from that without playing against them? To be honest, um, you know, we was in the next day. We got we got told off, and uh, but at the end of the day, it's football, and you can't. <laughs> we can never we can never linger on it. So uh, it was very much, you know, get it out of our systems. You know, straight away we played the Tuesday night in on the, or Wednesday, whatever it was. Straight away in the morning, we was in, went in the meetings. Uh, Obviously, you got told what was wrong, um, but then after that, it's it's move on and it's concentrate on the next game. So yes, yeah, obviously with the with the extra extra week break, it's 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 out of the system now and it's it's on to the next one. And we're still taking a lot of confidence in our performances um, in the league and what we've been doing recently. So um, yeah, we're we're going into it nice and confident. Yeah, and certainly in the league. At home, I mean, you really turned things around after maybe a sticky start. What sort of change with, with the performances at Hyde Park do you think to start getting the goals and getting the results that you've had there? Um, I don't know. Maybe sometimes things just fall for you a little bit. Like I know, I know it sounds crazy, but sometimes there's been games where earlier in the season where we've absolutely dominated. You know, uh, Cambridge maybe one of them um, wasn't too long ago, but you know, I think we had all sorts, all sorts of amount of shots. And sometimes it just don't go in for you, and you don't get that bit of luck. And then, you know, last few games it it has, and and sometimes it comes down to that. Sometimes it comes down to just keeping that clean sheet. Um, but yeah, you know, it's momentum. Sometimes just building that building that momentum, uh, not just as 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 a team, but you know, the staff, the player, the fans as well. You know, once they once we get the wins, they get confidence as well. And um, uh, yeah, that's as a club. That's what we that we have to build momentum and keep them home games. You know, very important at our, at our stadium to 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 get get a run of results and make it a fortress. Yeah, you've won your last two in the league. You're only outside the playoffs on on goal difference. Do you feel as though you're you're well placed to make a bit of a move over the next couple of weeks? We know how many games come over Christmas in particular. Yeah, of course. Um, you know, our our goal is to get promoted and. Um, Listen, you don't get promoted in November. Um, you have to make sure you're in a good position. For me, like um, I've been around, been around football a long time, and it's all about being putting yourself in a in a decent position around you know Christmas, January time, and then obviously you have the final push at the end, and that's that's when it when it really counts even more. So yeah, it's all about being in a good position, and you know sometimes it's nice to be to be the hunter.